Hi everyone, I just received my brand new portable espresso coffee machine and it is going to completely change how you travel and how you camp, how you go in your RV because you're gonna have amazing coffee right at your fingertips all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Um, the box just shows a few simple pictures. It says how it has a really big lithium ion battery that's going to last a really long time. Um, it has hot and cold brew functions and a really portable design. Um, same thing on the other side of the box. So like I mentioned before, this is great for traveling with um, and making sure that you don't ever have to go without your favorite beverage, coffee or espresso. Um, you can use it in the car, you can use it while you're camping, you can use it um, in your RV. It has so many different uses and one thing I love, which you're going to see in a second, it comes in this really nice traveling case. So you can completely pack this up and take it with you anywhere. So everything is nice in this small portable case. So let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so here is the first thing I see. I think this is one of the coffee filters. Again, I'm gonna go over everything. Right now, we're just gonna take a look at everything that's inside the box. Here is a towel that'll be useful for cleaning or for just storage. Um, another little scoop. This is going to be good for measuring coffee. Um, this machine does work with ground coffee or it also can work with um, the NS capsules if you have those as well. So inside here we have our user guide. This is just a little cleaning brush and a charger cord to make sure that that big battery is always charged. So it has a nice USB. If you have a USB port in your car, you'll be able to charge this anytime. So here is the user guide. It just has, again, a little bit of information about how to set it up, a little bit about the machine. One thing I didn't tell you about yet is it has 20 bars of pressure. So that's gonna make sure that you get a really, really rich crema on top of your espresso. So that pressure is gonna really prove that this machine is um, just like a coffee machine that you would get at a coffee shop or you're gonna get an espresso that's just as good as something you can make at home. So here is the machine itself. Again, you can see it's in this nice carrying bag, super small, and here it is. So very portable, super light. It has just one touch button to start and it's completely hands-free once it starts brewing. So once you turn this on, you're gonna be able to just leave it. It's gonna brew all on its own and your espresso is going to go right into this convenient cup. So you can use this cup to drink from. Imagine just making this in your car, having the espresso come right out and being ready to go. So here is where the coffee is going to drain from. And up top here, let's open this up. I believe this is where we're going to put the coffee, but I'm gonna show you all of that once we get started. It does have these lines right in here, if you can see. Um, it says 50 milliliters, 70 and the max, so that you're gonna be able to um, measure your coffee perfectly. Here is the top that we're gonna snap right on. And on the back here, I believe is just where we're going to charge it. Um, this is going to be, if you need to charge it, there's the charging port and the simple on button on the front. So let's go ahead and grab some coffee and get started. Okay, so I'm ready to make some coffee using this awesome handheld machine. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're just going to unscrew this bottom cup, and then this bottom part also unscrews. So you're just gonna take this off, simple twist, and put the machine aside for now. And you can see that this capsule comes right out. This is just going to be the holder compartment. And this, you unscrew here, and this is going to be where you put your ground coffee. So you're just going to pack your ground coffee, we're gonna scoop it in here, and then pack it down. Then you put this top back on and put it back in the machine. If you wanted to use Nespresso capsules, and you can use this other um, compartment, which is just exactly like this one, except this is going to hold your Nespresso capsules, which you can see right there. And it would just, again, lock into here. So I'm gonna go ahead and scoop some coffee in and get it connected. So I'm using the little scoop that came with the machine and I'm just setting everything out on this convenient towel that they also provided. So just use one little scoop and then you can actually use the bottom of the scoop to pack the espresso down. You wanna pack it down because that really helps get a nice crema and um, a nice thick coffee. So it's all compacted in there. I put this top right back on and then we put it back in this and I'm gonna just screw it right back onto the bottom of the machine. Turn that nice and tight. Put this cup back on that's gonna catch our coffee. Give it a little twist. 
and now it's time to fill it up with water. So I'm just going to use cold water. This will actually heat up your water, go from cold to perfect espresso temperature in three to four minutes. So it's incredibly fast. So I'm gonna fill it with water, and then if you wanna do a cold brew coffee, you can just hold the button for four seconds, and then the light will turn on, and that's gonna brew it cold. But if you wanted to do a hot brew, which I'm gonna do, you just hold this on button for two seconds, and then it'll start heating it up, and then it'll beep when it's ready to actually extract. So we're gonna hold it to turn it on. Once we hear that beep, it means that the water's hot, and then you can just press it again, and it's gonna extract. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill it up and get it started. Okay, so I filled it with the water, hold it for four seconds, then we'll hear that beep and it'll be ready to go.